we dwell on from a perspective of something that happened before and we're just recycling it, but that we're constantly trying to grow from it and learn from it. So I challenged myself a couple years ago. I was getting kind of lazy in my composition. I said, I'm gonna start writing a new song every month. And it was probably the stupidest thing I ever did. <laughs> because I'm not really a person to have much anxiety, but man, we have a concert approaching and it's like four or five days before and I have nothing. That's a bad feeling. Well, this one came a little bit easier than usual. I was inspired by a debate that I heard on my favorite sports radio station in Dallas, 1310 The Ticket. Any P1s? We have any P1s? I heard a P1. All right. So you'll know what I'm talking about here. Uh, a few months ago, the Morning Musers had this serious debate. And, you know, I think that one of the greatest things about jazz music in particular is we can talk about things that are really hard to talk about. You've already heard me talk a lot about racism and diversity and the history of African-American culture and jazz music. And I, I thought that I wanted to write about this issue that I heard debated because I think it's a serious issue. And I want to tell you that after I explain this to you, I promise you, you're gonna think about me telling you this for a very long time. I dare say at least twice a day, you're gonna think about me. And my name's Stockton, it's right there on the sign. And the issue I wanna to talk to you about is how you put your pants on in the morning. Do you go sock, sock, pant, pant, or pant, pant, sock, sock? Have you ever thought about it? I had never really thought about it and talk, until I heard the morning users discussing it, and now I can't not think about it. And you're going to not be able to stop thinking about it now as well, okay? So I thought it would be easy. Already you're gonna remember this, right? Now listen, this is not an advertisement for the ticket. They have lots of money. This is an advertisement for me. This is shameless <laughs> self-promotion. You're like, man, I don't remember that guy's weird name, but he wrote a song about socks and pants. I want to go see him again sometime. And I hope you'll remember that and come join us. So I wanted to give this a title that really spoke to the subject matter. So I entitled it, Pant, Pant, Sock, Sock. <laughs>
so much so I don't know are you sock sock pant 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 sock sock could you hear the lyrics in there who was singing along you know you were pant pant I mean listen I can't compete with Joe Henderson but I can write a stupid thing that'll get stuck in your head so next time you're putting your pants on I just want you to think about me not in that way just think about me well hey we've had a great time playing for you here at the Grand